Maximizers and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Crystal. I'm a coupon coach and educator with my company, KristaMaximizer.com. Today's video is my Walgreens haul. And since the beginning of the quarantine, I decided to do as much of my video not in store as possible. So I'll be talking a little bit at home before we get there. And then of course, I'll talk some more when I get back home from the store. So this week I am gonna go to Walgreens. I have changed my shopping days for couponing from Sundays to Tuesdays because those are the days that my store restock and I imagine the stores could potentially be a little bit less crowded on Tuesdays. Last time I went on a Tuesday, it was like a breeze. So I'm really excited to actually go in and actually do a little bit of couponing. I do have my printable breakdown. It's linked in the description box so you guys can go ahead and print it out. I have drawn all over it. So I sat down and I did my coupon preparation and I decided what deals I'm gonna do. I fished out the coupons I was going to need in store I've clipped all my digitals I've done all the things so the deals that your girl are going after is Ajax um, I had a coupon in my Walgreens app. It says spend $10 on laundry care or dish soap and get 2,000 points. So I was like, hmm, I definitely need Ajax. So I'm most likely going to grab three bottles of Ajax. And then I'm going to grab an Arm & Hammer detergent and maybe a Persil. Because I've clipped a digital Persil and Arm & Hammer. That'll get me over the $10 threshold. Getting me some pods that I need. Dish soap I definitely need. And I'll get 2,000 points back. I was like, that's a fair deal. And then I'm not doing Garnier Fructis because I don't have the coupon. Not getting Kellogg cereal because I have a ton of Apple Jacks at home already. Storage bags I'm going to skip. The Scott's toilet paper, um, there's a $1.25 IVC coupon. If I see a toilet paper, I'm going to grab a toilet paper. I might even grab a paper towel too just to be on the safe side. And then the Arm & Hammer detergent. Skippy peanut butter is on sale two for four. I'm good on creamy peanut butter, but we don't have any crunchy. So if they have crunchy, I'm going to grab two of the crunchies. And then I'm going to get my favorite Twizzlers. And then I'm meant to right here to grab some lollipops. I'm probably going to grab some lollipops at CVS and Walgreens. But let me write them down here so that I don't forget. And that is all. I've loaded all my digital. So go through your Walgreens app. I have a spin 15, get 3,000 points in my Walgreens app. So what you need to do is hop over in your app and go to the section that says um, view all. Go to household and see what you have in there. I had a spin 15 get 3,000 points. Some people had a bunch of different ones in there. Um, I didn't have that. So here it is. Spin 15, get 3,000. And then I have a bunch of different points boosters. So here is the spin $10 and get 2,000 points. A lot of people have been doing the crest deal. I've seen that all over YouTube. I won't be doing it. Stacking all the coupons and getting a lot of toothpaste. I know it's a money maker. I just don't have the brain power within me to do that right now. I'm just being completely honest with you. To see like how many tubes of toothpaste I have to buy. How many coupons I have to clip and pray they come off in hopes of getting it. If you can do that deal, do it. Do it, do it, and get all those extra points. Right now, I'm just not in the frame of mind. I want to do, like, easy deals, and that's just me. But if you can do it, let me know in the comments if you do the Crest deal and you get tons of extra points because it looks like a great deal, but my brain hurts, and I don't have that spin 20, get 5, which would make it a even killer moneymaker. I only have a spin 15, get 3. So here's my breakdown. We're about to go in the store. We're going to wear our mask. I'm going to use my hand sanitizer. Clorox wipe the car or Lysol wipe the car, whatever wipes I have in my bag. Next, I will see you guys in store. Hey, Maximizers. Imagine my distraughtness when I went to edit this for you guys and I have no sound. So let me show you what I found. I was in Walgreens and I was excited to see that they had some Lysol spray on the shelf and again this was tuesday which is restock day so they had lots of sprays they had bathroom ones but then they had like the general rules and get paper towels and make your own lysol wipes if you're unable to get the wipes one other thing i've been doing is just using my wipes in store now this is where crystal gets a little distraught because i really really need ajax dish soap i'm not low on dish soap but i definitely need to restock my stockpile and they are completely out i also called on another store they were also out as well so i am gonna have to go back out to walgreens probably on friday when i make my uh weekly post office run to see if they are able to get another shipment. I know Tuesday's their restock day, but even though Tuesday's their restock day, they said they may get another truck later this week. I'm gonna go to two Walgreens, Friday or Saturday, whichever day I run to the post office, 
to see because the deal is great it's $1.99 and then we have 50 cents off coupons in our app and inserts now I'm grabbing the Arm & Hammer pods they are $2.99 and we have a $1 off coupon that we can use that's in our app and they're $2.99 and we have a $1 digital coupon in our Walgreens app so it makes them just $1.99 like Persil it is on sale for $4.94 and we have a $2 off coupon in our app that you can use that will make the Persil just two dollars and 94 cents um you can either get the pods or you can get the liquid and now i'm just going to pull up the coupons in the app so you can actually see all of the digital coupons that i just talked about so we have a one dollar coupon for arm and hammer liquid we have a two dollar coupon for Priscil, so you can choose either or the ajax coupon is 50 cents off then we have an arm and hammer pods coupon for a dollar off so you can go ahead and get Whatever ones you need um, currently based on the coupons you have and like I said, the needs that you have for your current stockpile. And I'm a little like, I don't want to say I'm nervous right now, but like I'm trying to remember what I said in store, which I don't always remember because sometimes I say stuff off the cuff. But anyway, we're going down the candy aisle. Your girl is grabbing her Twizzlers. They are two for four dollars. I'm addicted to these Twizzlers. I like regular Twizzlers too, but Pulling Pill is my jam. And then I go ahead and I grab some Blow Pop Lollipops, Strawberry and Watermelon. Now I am at the front of the store grabbing the IVC booklet because I remember that um, I wanted to grab some toilet paper and paper towels and they are in stock. So wait and wait until I show you guys. Wait until you see. So we're going to go to the aisle, but I wanted to get the booklet so you guys can see the coupon in the booklet so they're free they're at the front of the store they last for the whole month so grab one or two throw it in your coupon bag you don't have to give these two coupons to the cashier the cashiers let you keep them and oh my gosh holy paper aisle right they have toilet paper in stock look at all that toilet paper y'all paper towels they have everything i was so happy to go down this aisle so I decided not to get any toilet paper even though I was so excited because I had a decent amount. I decided to grab another pack of paper towels because I have been blowing through paper towels, no lie. I've been washing my hands more obviously so I've been using paper towels as opposed to like my towels that I would use regularly. And then I've been wiping down door handles and all that kind of stuff more. So we've just naturally been using more paper towels. So I'm actually blowing through them faster than toilet paper, which typically doesn't happen. So um, I'm just showing you here the toilet paper brands and things that are available and what you can grab. I'm going to go down and grab one of the Scott's paper towels. Let's check that out. Okay, now we're going down to the paper towels and I'm showing you in the booklet the $1.25 off coupon. So I'm going to grab one pack. So they're $5. I'm going to use the $1.25 coupon. It's going to make them $3.75. Typically, I would stack this with a manufacturer coupon, but I wasn't able to print any manufacturer coupons and there's none in any of our recent inserts. So I just went ahead and paid the $3.75 for it because it is something that we actually need to add to the stockpile. Do not want to get low on paper towels. Over here, peanut butter. I need to grab some crunchy Skippy. We're good on the the smooth one. Oh my gosh, I always call it smooth and it's not what it called. It's called um y'all, what am I creamy? Oh my gosh, I'm looking right at it and I still can't say the word creamy. Kinsley likes creamy. I like crunchy. So I go ahead and I grab crunchy. Yo, doing a voiceover is much harder than me just recording in store. I don't like it. And then I'm just showing you the other condiments and stuff that they have in stock if your stores are still low. Like my mom said that in Baltimore, Walmart, and the grocery stores are still wiped out. So make sure you guys go and check your local Walgreens and CVS because mine have both been stocked. And this is me showing you me me getting what I was supposed to get on the breakdown. Excuse me, me making sure I'm grabbing everything that I said I was going to get on the breakdown. So now I think we are going to go ahead and tally up everything because I think this is everything. No, I lied. I'm going to go to the soda aisle. So now let's go to the soda aisle and I'll show you what I'm going to get there. Over here, I'm showing you that the Fiji waters are two for four dollars. And I'm explaining that I bought a case of Fiji water from Walmart and it made them a dollar and 91 cents each. And I got 12 of them. So next time this deal comes around, I may or may not indulge or I'm going to see if I can just order another case from Walmart because it is about eight cents cheaper per bottle. Then I go over here and I decide, hmm, do I make a bad choice and get soda? And guess what, y'all? I do. I do. I decide that YOLO, I'm going to go ahead and get soda. So I'm going to grab a Fanta Orange. I'm going to grab a Dr. Pepper. And I'm going to go ahead and grab a Sprite. Because the 12 packs are 3 for $9.99. And it makes them like $3.33 each. 
at Walmart, these things are usually around $4.99. I shouldn't be drinking soda, but like I said, YOLO, quarantine, I'm ge- I'm drinking what I like and I'm eating what I like. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and grab the Dr. Pepper and then I'm going to go ahead and grab a Sprite. The storage bags are on sale again. Buy one, get two free for $2.79. This is a great deal because it makes them cheaper than Wal. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, y'all. It makes them cheaper than Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree, they're a dollar at Walgreens it makes them 93 cents per box and then I'm just walking around looking at the snacks Kinsley asked me to buy goldfish and I try to explain to her we already have goldfish at home and then I go home and I show her but she was trying to get me in the store y'all trying to get me to buy her goldfish but if you need snacks or anything you can see my store is stocked up so again check your store and see what they have and this is me telling the child we already have goldfish put those back all right so now I forget what I'm gonna do next but let's go through and see oh I remember I was showing you guys the tags white tags are for the whole entire month yellow tags are for the week so if you see a white tag know that the deal is good for the whole week like that yellow tag shows the deal ends on May 9th so it's a week-long deal if the deal is a white tag it means the deal is all month so those goldfish are on sale all month so if I need more goldfish for Kinsley I know that I can get them at Walgreens because they're on sale and this is her sitting on the cart and it's so hard to shop with a five-year-old especially during quarantine um, but I let her stay out the cart for once and then I go over here and I look at the other snacks and stuff just to see if there's anything on clearance or on sale that we need or low-key want but there was nothing so now let's tally up everything so what did your girl get your girl got Twizzlers two for four peanut butter two for four the lollipops are two for a dollar the sodas three for 9.99 so here is my transaction breakdown it's linked in the description box and I write everything down that I'm going to di- get. Then I do the total before coupons, which is $27.98. And then I tell you the coupons I'm going to use, which is a dollar in the app for the Arm & Hammer, a dollar and 25 cents IVC booklet coupon for the Scots. And I think that is all. And then I'm showing you that I have a spend 15, get 3,000 points. So for spending um, $15 or more, I'm going to get 3,000 points. So I'm going to pay with cash because if it's a when you spend, you want to spend your money. After coupons, my total will be $25.73. I'm showing you the coupons again in the app. I'm going to pay $25.73 at the register. There's me showing you guys all the coupons. I'm going to pay $25.73 plus tax and I'm going to get 3,000 points back. Now... What you're going to see in a second is that me and Kinsley to the register and look what we find clearance 50 to 80 percent off clearance. So there's a bunch of randoms in this little bin right here. Then they have tons of like Easter clearance that is on sale. So it's super duper cheap. So I actually go back to the aisle and I'm like, hmm, if there's clearance over here, it's probably clearance over there. So we take a walk over there and I wanted to see if there's any more of that slime she likes on sale. And guess what, y'all? It was. So we're going to go over here. We're going to find um, two things of slime. And then I'm like, oh, look, they did have root beer because I really wanted root beer when I was looking at the soda, but they were out. So now we're going to go over here to this little section where they have 80% off. And I was able to grab her two things of slime and they were like both less than 99 cents so this green one i think was like 63 cents and then that peanut butter one was like 99 cents but as you saw in my cvs video if you haven't i'll link it here i already grabbed some like egg dyeing kits for next year what i found is that one year is enough time to have them sit for them to work because i had some from two years ago and they didn't work so that's why i only grabbed um the egg dyeing kits from cvs but definitely check your walgreens too they may have clearance and 80 percent is the lowest that it's going this year the cashier says it won't be marked down anymore so we grabbed two clearance items so it is going to add i think like two dollars and some change to our total with the text that's added in okay so we're gonna go to the register and i will see you guys when we get back home y'all she was so freaking excited for the slime like she loves it so much all right, Maximizers, we are back home from Walgreens, and here is our haul. So we got the paper towels to add because we've been blowing through paper towels. I've been wiping down so much stuff. So I grabbed an extra pack of paper towels. I used that $1.25 off coupon in the Walgreens booklet here. So it made them just $3.75. So again, this booklet is free for everyone. It's in the front of the store. And I mean, I'm trying to find the coupon. 
it's here it's here here it is dollar and 25 cents off you can use it for the whole entire month so get your booklet and yes there is a digital one but like i said before if you use the digital it only works once this you can use all month long okay then i did impulse grab the soda they were three for 9.99 so it makes them like three dollars and 33 cents each um i got fanta orange dr pepper and sprite grab myself two crunchy peanut butters two for four dollars um, Arm and Hammer Pods, they were $2.99 with the $1 digital, made them $1.99. My favorite Twizzlers were two for four, and Lollipops that were two for a dollar, the big blow pops. So I also received this Spem 30 Get Six. I will be trying to go to another Walgreens probably this weekend, maybe Friday or Saturday. I'll venture out again because I need Ajax. I need dish soap. So I'm going to go out to another Walgreens probably on Friday if I get the courage to go out again when I need to check my P.O. box because I do need to check my P.O. box. So I'll swing by a Walgreens to see if they have any Ajax um, later this weekend. So here's my receipt. Okay, I made a $1 cash donation for Red Nose Day. Um, I had a uh, spend 15, get a 3,000 points booster in my account. So my subtotal was $28.31. I did buy Kinsley two things of slime on clearance, and they were fairly cheap. Let me see. Like, look, they came out to $0.59 cents for one of them, and then the other one was $0.99. Cents, okay, so that stuff was super cheap for her. So, I paid $30.23 with tax. Let's see down here. It says I saved 41%. I started the day with 15,000 points. I earned 280 everyday points, 3,000 bonus points for a total of 19,140 points. So, I will take it. So, your girl paid $28, got $3 back. So, all this stuff cost me $25. i am not upset at all at it. And I have this to use. So, if I can find Ajax at another store... I will probably grab one of the Arm & Hammer liquids because I have a coupon for that. I also have a coupon for the Persil. And then I also have, um, I can always use more toilet paper and paper towels. So if they have that, I can grab one of those. Get my total to $30 and get some more points back, okay? So if you guys have any questions about my Walgreens haul, comment down below. Let me know if you're going to Walgreens, if your state is opening up, what does your couponing look like? Again, my new couponing day is going to be Tuesday because that's the restock day. I just want you guys to stay safe as you are shopping and going out. So yeah, make sure you click the link in the description box and hop on my email list. I'm going to be sending out emails all through this week and I'm going to be going live and I will alert my email list when I will be live. And if you didn't know, my Shop With A Purpose course is underway. So if you have been overwhelmed with grocery shopping, if you have anxiety, if you're over budget, if you're really struggling to get a handle on couponing, grocery shopping and meal planning the shop with the purpose course is for you it is 11 modules that walks you through a deep dive of how to coupon how to budget meal plan and strategic grocery shop like a boss so if you are ready to shop with the purpose save more money maximize your life one coupon at a time click the link in the description box and get the course today it is 50 percent off the retail price and that is a killer 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 deal so that's also in the description box but that's pretty much it y'all i'm gonna thank Thank you guys so much for your love and support i really really appreciate each and every one of you if you could watch a video or two and let the ads play through it would really help kinsley and i and as always please like share and subscribe thank you all so much for watching and i will see you in the next video